Hello students, today we are going to simulate and synthesis of SR flip-flop using all modeling methods. Flip-flops Flip-flops are digital circuits that can be in one of two states. Flip-flops maintain their state indefinitely until an input pulse called a trigger is received. When a trigger is received, the flip-flop outputs change state according to defined rules and remain in those states until an another trigger is received. Flip-flop circuits are interconnected to form the logic gates for the digital integrated circuits used in memory chips and microprocessors. Flip-flops can be used to store one bit or binary digit of data. There are several different kinds of flip-flop circuits with designators such as T, toggle, SR, set or reset, JK, and D, delay. A flip-flop typically includes 0, 1, or 2 input signals as well as a clock signal and an output signal. Some flip-flops also include a clear input signal to reset the current output. The first one is SR flip-flop. The set reset flip-flop is designed with the help of two NOR gates and also two NAND gates. The design of such a flip-flop includes two inputs called the set and reset. There are also two outputs that is Q and Q bar. Logic diagram. Logic diagram of the SR flip flop is given below. Input for the first NAND gate S and clock and second NAND gate R and clock. Uh, another two NAND gates are interconnected in this logic diagram. The symbol of the SR flip flop. Two inputs, S and R, and one clock input, and two outputs, that is Q and Q bar. The table of SR flip flop is given below. When clock is undefined, the S is 0 and R is 0, the Q will be no change, that is previous state. When the values are changed to S is equal to 0 and R is equal to 1, the output is Q is 0, that is the reset condition. And when the S becomes 1 and R becomes 0, the output becomes 1, that is set. When both inputs S and R is equal to 1, the flip-flop state will be forbidden. The next step is simulation. Double click on project navigator. And close any projects open. Go to file. Close project. Click on new project. And type the name as SR flip flop. And click on next next and finish right click on project name new source and click on verilog module file name as sr flip flop and click on next next and finish type the code here here i have written the code for SR flip flop, okay. Here the inputs are S, yes, R, and clock, and outputs are Q and Q bar. Okay, I have used uh, K statements in behavioral style modeling. Okay, and save the code. Click on implementation, click on SR flip flop and double click on synthesize xst
and expand this window double click on check syntax and check the view rtl schematic three inputs two outputs okay this nand gates and technology schematic lut is input buffers and output buffers okay design summary reports synthesis report here lut is uh, and flip flops latches uh, clock buffers uh, input buffers okay and timing for the time taken is 12 seconds SST for behavioral modeling okay and close this report and this technology schematic and the RTL schematic now I am writing the test bench for SR flip flop right click on the project name click on new source and click on very large text picture type the name as sr flip flop underscore tb and click on next and click on next and finish type the stimulus here here I have given the inputs initially s is equal to 0 r is equal to 0 and clock is equal to 0 wait for 100 nanoseconds then s and r will be 0 and another 100 nanoseconds sr will be 1 and wait for 100 nanoseconds sr will be 2 and after 100 nanoseconds sr will be 3 and after that wait for 100 nanoseconds and finish and clock signal will be 50 nanoseconds ok how to write the clock in this manner always space hash 50 clock that is equal to negation of clock and semicolon ok this is the test bench for SR flip flop ok now coming to simulation part click on simulation and click on sr flip flop underscore tb go to process window and double click on simulate behavioral model save the test bench In the first transition inputs yes 0 r 0 and clock is 0 I have not changed any value here from here I have changed value to yes 0 and r equal to 0 and clock is equal to 0 whenever the clock becomes 1 the output is changed to q equal to 0 and q bar equal to 1 when s is equal to 0 and r is equal to 1 ok that is reset condition next state clock becomes 0 the output is not changed when I have changed it to s is equal to 1 and r equal to 0 when clock pulse becomes 1 the output is changed to q equal to 1 and q bar equal to 0 so this is the set condition ok whenever I have give, given the inputs s is equal to 1 and r equal to 1 and clock 0 the outputs is not changed and the last transition whenever the clock becomes 1 the output becomes q1 and q bar equal to 1 so that is the forbidden state of the flip flop ok this concludes the 
behavioral style modeling of star flip flop now the next one is data flow type of modeling here the star flip flop module sr and clock are the inputs q and q bar are the outputs i have used here wires s1 and r1 and i have written the code in assign format that is assigning the outputs to uh, to the inputs okay and uh, save the code and click on the implementation click on sr flip flop and synthesize xst and check syntax and view rtl schematic okay and technology schematic okay, and summary reports synthesis report bells inverters lut's how many used here i buffers and time taken is 4 seconds and close this tech report technology and rtl and the next step is simulation click on this simple simulation and click on this sr flip flop underscore tv and double click on simulate behavioral model click on this default and zoom to full view whenever s becomes 0 and r becomes 1 the q becomes 0 and q bar becomes 1 and clock input is 1 and uh, when s becomes 1 and r becomes 0 and clock equal to 1 then q1 q bar equal to 0 and both inputs are 1 and q q bar will be 1 when the clock pulse is 1 ok when we have got the same outputs that are obtained from behavioral cell modeling from data flow also now the next one is gate level modeling of sr flip flop here the inputs sr and clock and input outputs are used here that is q and q bar ok and i have written the code using nand gates ok nand n1 s1 and s clock and nand n2 r1 r and clock and so on this is the gate level modeling of sr flip flop ok the next step is click on implementation click on sr flip flop and synthesize xst save the code and synthesize xst There is one, one warning, please ignore and check syntax. And view RTL schematic. Okay. And view technology schematic. And design summary report. Synthesis report. here inverters, LUTs and input buffers and output buffers 
and completion time 6 seconds ok close all windows and coming to simulation part click on simulation click on sr flip-flap underscore tv go to process window double click on simulate behavioral model click on this default zoom to full view we have got the output same as in behavioral style modeling whenever the S, S1 R1 is become the output will be forbidden and state ok this completes the SR flip-flop in all modeling methods thank you